Hi, my name is Mark Sho. I'm an actor, dancer, and singer. I am from San Jose. I moved here about 11 months ago to pursue my passion for acting. I love this city because it's filled with crowded people and filled with people who are, are with hope and determination. The passion of everyone in this city is so, is so great and it motivates me even more to want to become a better actor and improve myself as an, as an actor. I love um, this city a lot. <laughs> and um, I, I started acting when I was a little kid. Um, and it started when I was a kid. I, every time I watch a movie, I'll get inspired. And, or every time I wake up with a uh, breakfast that my mom cooked, like song yo bing, yo tiao, ma zhang. And it's something that, that I wake up to and then I'll take my notebook and I'll write a movie script or I'll write a, a, a script and, and wake up my little brother early in the morning and then I'll take my Panasonic M10 VHS camcorder and I'll record us and record a, a whole movie. And, um, and after that I'll draw a picture and then make a cover for that movie. One of the movies that I grew up with uh, that inspired me is The Godfather. Uh, I love how the Godfather, the way he portrayed the character, the physicality, the, the movement, the voice that he created for this character, especially the voice. Um, I really love the voice where he was like, he goes, we know each other many years. Well, this is the first time you came to me for counsel, for help. I can't remember the last time you invited me to your house for a cup of coffee, even though my wife is godmother to your only child. And it was so cool how he created this voice for this character and how he did the physicality and, and it's just so different. And especially, I didn't even notice that he had cotton balls um, the whole time until I got older. And um, he won a lot of Academy Awards. Um, and the Godfather, he won an Academy Award, but he rejected the Academy Awards because of how Americans treated Indian people very poorly. And, and it really touches my heart that he, he's so honest and truthful with himself as a person. And I think that's what we're missing a lot in this, this world of being honest and not being afraid of being who you are. And, and it's scary. It's definitely scary because, I mean, I, I'm pretty, I'm, I'm scared, you know, sometimes facing the reality and being truthful sometimes. But sometimes that's what we're missing and being honest is what we need in this world. And a lot of people see him as a, a legendary actor, but I see him more than just a legendary actor. I see him as a person and a, a really honest person. His name is Marlon Brando.